All right, I turned on the headlights and uh, now the vehicle stalled on, stalled on me. Now I'm trying to start it back up again. It died on me again. It will not stay running. Start it again. It will not stay running. And reduced engine power is on again. Uh, car just died. The car vehicle will not stay running. So I'm going to go ahead and turn off the lights again. Let's try to start it up again. vehicle did not stall yet but I definitely can't use my my throttle does not operate the car is running but there's no response to that all right okay Let's see what kind of codes we got now if any at all read trouble codes Okay, we have that code that came up again. The U0107, lost communication. I gotta charge up my bad, my scanner. Okay, we got that code. So, the only way I can get back home because my throttle is not working and I have reduced engine power on my screen. My lights are off. My AC is on I'm gonna go ahead and erase that and I'm gonna back it on up and I'm gonna clear the computer I'm gonna reset the computer so to speak and okay now I should have throttle uh, response All right so my AC is off I'm gonna clear the trouble codes it didn't take All right, so I'm driving, lights are off, and I'm gonna kick on my AC, because it will not happen unless I have the AC on. And it just went into limp mode just now. So it just went in, matter of fact, the engine stalled when I kicked on the AC. And again, the vehicle has no response to the pedal. You know, it's just important to find out uh, the things that you do uh, that make the car act funny. When it's electrical, something's going to happen normally. Uh, like this one, you turn on the AC, the car will stall, it'll go into reduced engine mode, limp mode, and also when you turn on the lights, it'll go into limp mode. You know, that's like... Uh, I gotta see how they, I gotta pull up the schematic and see how these things are connected. It sure is beginning to sound like I got a bad ground problem. Uh, since we're talking about the lights and the AC unit, I mean, that's two different circuits, I think. So I'm gonna pull up the schematic and we're gonna find out how these come together and what, you know, the modules are actually how they tie in together basically so I can fix this problem uh, I'm, susp I'm suspecting that I'm gonna find a ground wire that's controlling both of them uh, I don't know but let's go in the house and uh, get on the computer and find out all right so if you're curious of how these things uh, go together the headlights and the uh, and the AC unit we're gonna track it down and here's our headlights, our high beams and our low beams. And they run along this wire and they go to the ground 104. And that's our headlights. When we turn the headlights on, remember the vehicle died. And it's tied into 104. Alright? 
Now on the screen here, we have the the throttle body, the throttle act, the throttle body itself, right there, and that's that unit. You know, that's you know, that's like you know, perforated. That has little dots around it. That is the control unit itself. And if you notice, the common factor is it comes out of the at the throttle body and it goes down this wire and you also hit a ground 104 and that's our common uh that's our common factor right there so what i did is i just found that that wire which i showed you on the early part of the video and uh that's not the right ground this is the right ground and uh and that's where that wire is that's that black wire with the white stripe they're spliced in together and they control both circuits so that's our common uh that's our common ground wire right there okay that's it y'all all right what it ended up doing is uh on this harness uh this, which goes back here it follows this harness back in the back there's a ground wire right here it's a black wire with a white stripe uh, and that was a bad ground. So uh, I, what I did, I loosened it up, I cleaned it up, cleaned up the mating surface, which is on the motor, and I tightened it down really good, and that may have solved the problem. I did try to rewire it when I stopped myself. I rewired two wires going directly up to the throttle body module, which is this right here. Uh, but that didn't do anything. It was all in the ground. I just stopped and I said, let me check that ground before I get into all that, which I should have did in the first place. Uh, so I'm gonna take this to a test drive and I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the wires as they are for right now. And uh, let's see if I can get it to go into uh, limp mode now. All right. All right. Where I'm gonna set this. I guess I can set it there for right now. Yeah. All right. I got the AC on. I got the lights on. No change. So so far so good on that. You know, it sounded like a power problem, a ground problem though, with the lights uh, killing the engine. You know. And the AC, when it powers up, it's pulling more juice. So it sounded like a ground problem. So, so I'm kind of kicking myself right now for cutting those two wires. Uh, but I'm just, to be honest with you, I'm just used to replacing the entire harness when I get a reduced engine power mode. I just go ahead and redo all the wires. That way I don't have to dig in the harness or anything. Uh, and it's running great right now. AC is on max. I'm gonna turn my lights back off. Yeah, my AC is on. Turn my lights back on. I'm still driving. So far, so good. If I can make it two or three blocks with the AC on and the lights on, uh, that'll be a fix. I've been on this thing for a couple hours already so it takes time to do diagnostics uh, you know get schematics and take it for a test drive and all that other stuff and people take it for granted I uh, expect you to just know you know have x-ray vision or something or but it's not like that it takes some work it takes some research uh, man I think it's good I think it's good I'm gonna call him up here right now and I'm gonna get paid and I'm gonna go on vacation is my plan so all right so that was a u0107 code is what I got and all right, that will conclude this video of uh, trouble code U0107. Okay, the ground wire, the back of the motor. And I'll talk to y'all later. Like or subscribe. Questions, comments down below. Later on, y'all. Peace.